perhaps I can be of assistance? Oh, Mr. Jackal. Um, yeah, picking locks is a skill I acquired under the tutelage of Stone Cold. Uh, all I need is one of your bobby pins. Oh, no, 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 that's sweet of you to offer, really, but, but there's no need. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, it's probably easier for security to take care of it anyway. Uh, what's behind the door? Oh, it's, uh, um, well, I, I actually was, was trying to find someplace quiet, somewhere where you and I could talk. You wanted to seek my advice on capturing the heart of Stone Cold. I'm not interested in Stone Cold. In Jason. Well, since when? It's always been you, Mr. Jackal. <sighs> yeah, ever since you came into the ER with your foot, I, I, I just, I couldn't tell you how I really felt because you were a patient. You mean a stalker? Oh no, there were so many people around that night that you brought me those, those beautiful flowers. I, I swear, I was only trying to throw off suspicion. So, that's why you put the moves on my mentor? Oh, I, I wasn't asking Jason how. No, I was just hoping that once he spent time with me, I could convince him to put in a good word with you. Yeah, Jason is not my type. He's not nearly as smart and, and, and as funny and, and as smart as you. And you're such a good listener. You know, I, I'm, I'm handy, too. Well, let me help you with that. Oh, no, no, really. It's okay. It's okay. I, um, I know someone we can be alone. So this is uh our force, the one they never use, right? Cause it's... You start begging for more. What are you What are you doing? Oh, um, do you want me to stop? Am I moving too fast? No. No, I'm. Are, are you sure you don't want me just to help you get into that other room? God, I'm think I'm such a slut. No, I don't. I don't. I, I don't. I'm not usually like this. It, it's just... Just being here with you. It's... Oh, God, I knew I would screw this up. I'm such an idiot. You're not. Really. Do you still like me, Mr. Jack? Uh, you, you can just call me... You know what? You, you can call me whatever you want. <laughs> so if I do this? Yeah, I know. I, I, wow. It's just that I thought, you know, we'd take it slow. Maybe get to know each other. I don't know, go bowling a couple times. Yeah. I saw you practicing last week. You know, we had a lot in common. Yeah. We could do. Um, Look, I'm, uh, um, I, oh, okay. Uh, I'm flattered by your attentions. I really am. It's just, I, I don't have a lot of real life experience in this arena. We'll make it up as we go. doing the only thing that's keeping him alive is that ventilator and medcam can't wait to have him shipped off the county so i guess alzheimer's patients don't qualify for decent care and compassion the machine breathing for you that's some kind of life he wouldn't want it he said as much i think he knew what this was going to put you through I signed the DNR. What else can I do? Let go. I didn't know your dad very well. But I know what it's like to feel helpless. I want to get something right just once. Roger asked to be released for him and for you. Isn't that his call?
results of Curtis's DNA test came back. He's taking Anna to New York with him. When? As soon as the court signs off. You know what I did last week? I, um, I sent a check to the Yale Alumni Society. Not enough to name a building after me or anything, but I thought Anna might want to go there someday. So much for planning ahead, right? I mean, New York City's not that far away. The social worker says it's not best if I visit. Do you want me to, uh, talk to Curtis? <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't think it would do much good. He doesn't want me involved at all. And you know, I really don't think that he has Anna's best interest at heart, and I'm not just saying that. You, you think he, he wants her money? I don't know. But why wouldn't Stacy tell him that she was pregnant? It doesn't make any sense. I don't know. She must have had her reasons. What if he's impatient? What if he flies off the handle? What if he's a violent guy? Right, just let me, let me see what I can do, okay? escort you to the nurse's station? No. No. If, if anyone finds out about us, I could get into serious trouble. Oh. <laughs> We're enough. I'm not kidding. Okay, I could get kicked out of the nursing program, and you just have to promise me that you're not going to tell anyone. Not a soul. Not even your closest friends. If you're not, fair angel, I will carry the secret of our sweet love to the ends of the earth. So, uh, what, what time do you get off of work? Because I was thinking maybe we could go to this uh, killer pancake house. <laughs> Are you okay? Oh, I'm, f I'm fine. I'm fine. But don't you have work to do? Get out of there fast enough. It's a hurry. I have to get back to work. At least you could do is show some appreciation. You just witness poetry in motion. See how the tumor was clinging to the dirt? Yeah. You almost caused the spinal fluid. I saw a chance to take the whole thing, and I went for it. I took a risk, and it paid off. You should try it sometime. You might like it. It's not so easy for some of us. Baylor, life is full of risks. Sometimes you got to go with your gut. Especially if your gut is telling you to kiss me again. I can't, Patrick. I have too much to lose. Who says you can't have it all?